by Shannon and Michael with Healthcare Genius. This is a video in our series, Medicare in a Minute, that we, where we talk about Medicaid. We see a lot of confusion between Medicare and Medicaid. So we want to make sure it's crystal clear how each program impacts you if it does. So as you know, Medicare is the program that for a lot of us when we retire, um, we'll sign up for, for healthcare coverage. Now, Michael, what is Medicaid? How does it work for retirees? And how does it, or can it correlate with Medicare? Yeah, so um, there are a group of individuals in retirement, typically if they have lower income, sometimes uh, with certain illnesses that will qualify for Medicaid. Uh, they're known as dual eligible, so basically they're covered under both Medicare and Medicaid. And oftentimes the state, because the Medicaid programs are based on the state you live in, um, the state will actually pick up some of the premiums or all of the premiums of that um, Medicare Part B coverage. So, um, and then the other thing that Medicaid, uh, Medicare does not cover long-term care, but Medicaid can provide coverage for long-term care. However, there's a lot of financial stipulations um, uh, as far as assets and so forth, whether um, that basically depend on whether or not Medicaid will cover your coverage if you had to go into a nursing home or assisted living. So right. just, just remember there are two different programs. Medicare, everybody who turns 65 in most cases is gonna sign up for Medicare. Uh, we've already discussed that, but Medicaid will be for um, a certain select group of individuals who uh, traditionally have lower incomes. That's right, so if you do have a lower income, Medicaid can really fill in the holes and cover you in a lot of different ways. If you aren't a lower income individual when you retire, you don't have to worry about Medicaid, but you do have to worry about how you're gonna pay for Medicare and the things that it doesn't cover like long-term care. That's right. Thank you, have a good day.